Hello friends, this is Erica with Aurora Heart Healing and I am here today because I wanted to walk through the Column of Light meditation. This meditation really helps me ground myself as well as the clients that walk through the door or on my Zoom meeting sessions. These types of meditations really help people especially when they're going through a lot there's a lot of processing if you've ever done a healing session you know that there is high emotions uh, there's a lot of things that are moving around and shifting within you and sometimes you don't necessarily know how to handle all of them or you're living life and you're overwhelmed with all of the different things that are happening in life so this is a really great way to center yourself, ground yourself, really bring yourself into alignment and calm yourself down a little bit when things are just getting really overwhelming and hard. One of the things that I like to do is pretend that there is a column of light, white light coming out through the top of my head. And this white light is bringing power, energy from up from universe, from heaven, from God, from source, whatever you want to call this, because no matter what, we're just wanting to focus on being loving and loving ourselves and healing. And what is more pure than love, right? We just want to bring in all of that love. And if you want to call it love, then let's think of it that way. Your connection, you are bringing in and you are focusing on this column of light coming from up in the universe and the sky and the spaces and all the stars and the moon and it is just radiating down in through your head and as this is radiating through your head it is actually moving down down all the way through your stomach through your spinal cord all the way down through your bottom, down into the ground. And the ground is also sharing its column of light up through your body. And as it goes, as the light goes down through your body, and you're visualizing this going all the way down, you're allowing your energy to just slowly circulate into the ground and then you are also pulling that energy up, up, up through your body, through your spinal cord, all the way up into the universe. And we are creating a circuit of bringing that energy up and down. Breathing it up, up, bringing it down, going all the way down. You can really feel the calmness really circulating and I'm moving my hands up and down to just show you exactly what this column of light looks like. It's really just pulling from the earth and pulling up and then pushing towards the universe. And then the universe reciprocates with love and brings down in through your body in through that amazing vessel and then goes all the way down into the earth and then reciprocates again and then just this beautiful circuitry that we are a part of and really acknowledging the fact that we are connected with earth and with sky with stars and with plants and nature 
and just keep bringing it in and down and up and out. And you are the column of light. This meditation really brings in a higher frequency because you're really connecting with the contraction and the expansion of the universe. You're bringing in what comes in and what goes out and noticing how you are part of that. A lot of times when I am doing this meditation, my hands actually tingle and pulsate, which is something that I'm experiencing right now, which is amazing. But you could just feel the way that you are within the vibration of the earth and your connection with other people as well. This column of light practice you can do for however long you need or want to really bring yourself into center, but also to protect yourself from outside energy. This is actually something that I do before I go and speak in front of a large group. I had this happen just today actually, where I was sitting at a marketing event group and I could feel someone's anxieties and they were very overwhelming. They were super nervous about speaking. I've done this so many times that I was like, this is definitely not mine, but I could feel it and I could sense it in my field. So I just sat there and I did the column of light meditation and I just imagined me gently. We don't want to be pushing or forcing people's energy out of our field, but we just want to say, hey, this is my space. I am setting my boundary and unfortunately you're not welcome in it right now. We can talk like this, we can communicate, but you are not allowed to penetrate my energetic bubble. And it really helped me calm the anxiety that I was feeling, that I was sensing, because a lot of times when we're empaths, then we absorb the energy. We can absorb the energy. But that's one of the things that we really want to avoid is absorbing the energy because it'll ruin our day, ruin our family's day, and we already have enough crap to deal with and stuff. Why take on another set of stuff, right? So just take that in mind. Doing that and... Of course, I'm doing the hand motions because it's helped me really uh, explain to my clients how to do it and what the process is, but you are welcome to do it however you need to. You can just sit and imagine, you can breathe it out, visualize, close your eyes and do it, whatever feels the most comfortable for you, but just do it. Help yourself push gently, allow those other extra energies to just kind of flow away from you. They don't belong in your space and that's okay. I hope you enjoyed this video and please take a look at all of my other videos and learn a little bit more about what I do. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Thank you so much. And again, Erica with Aurora Heart Healing.